what is happening? So we got a little break from the rain, not complaining. So we're gonna get back at our pillars and beams here. So we'll kind of take a look here and show you guys what we're working with. All right, so basically all the big stones you can see we gathered from around the property. There's no shortage of big stones. We're working with the Type S green for the stone. And then we're doing the 5,000 on top for our brackets. Got just one set done here. We gotta finish that one today. Still cloudy, but no rain today. We will get our shoe put on today. And then we will be finishing this one. Now eventually, after I finish the piers, I am gonna do a solid rock wall in between these, all the way around. Of course, we got the other two we gotta get raised up. So, we're almost there. All right, so to explain a little more about this whole foundation here, basically what I did was I dug holes two and a half foot deep, almost two and a half foot, two foot around, compacted gravel and broken up concrete chunks. Oh yeah, lift by lift. Now up the center of those is half inch rebar, two pieces, comes all the way up. And then we tie it into the center sections of each of the big pylons kind of to help. So, um, and then from there, we basically just bring the rebar up, mortar the stones together with the pipe S, stack the stones, and then I'm doing the 5,000 on top. So here's an update on some of our plants. These Gerber daisies are just taking off. So we gotta go get those planted. But I really wanted to show everyone, we did this once before with romaine and it did start growing, but some animal got to it. So we're trying it again. We're gonna keep it up here in the greenhouse. Hopefully they'll stay safe in there. But look at the celery. Look at that. This is just a couple of days worth and it has already started regrowing. And then look at this green onions. I've got these little green onion sprouts in here that I did and they are also sprouting already. That is so cool. So I just put these romaine stalks in because like I said in my previous video, I was not able to find any romaine lettuce, but we ordered seeds, so it's gonna be a while, but we'll see what these do, and maybe we can get some leaves off of them until we get some full-grown romaine growing. But all of my flowers are really starting to bloom. These squash have just really taken off. The bell peppers are doing great. The tomatoes look awesome. Everything looks really awesome. Heading back down the hill to do some work and almost stepped on this guy. Pretty long, we think two foot.
getting real close to being able to frame up the floor. Days. It's pretty exciting. Out of the shadows, bound for the gallows, a dead man walking to love came calling. Rise up, rise up, rise up, rise up, six feet under. So I bought a lot and we jumbled it all into this small Palawid container garden and everything just started getting so big. We got our cucumbers here that just needed more space. The squash are getting so big they needed more space and the green beans needed more space. And as you can see we need more dirt because we've got some other things that we're moving around. I'm going to be moving those tomatoes. Look how big they are. And the bell peppers will be getting spread out all along here. I let the kale spread out a little bit more since I moved those green beans. I moved the big bell pepper plant here. So we'll just see how everything goes. All right, everything's moved. We got the tomato plants here, green beans, squash. I moved the cucumbers here and separated them. And now I think I'm gonna do the broccoli seeds here. inside of the house. I mean, I'm actually standing in the basement area, but, but the floor is gonna be sitting here very soon. We're about to place the last bracket into the concrete. And once that's done, we're basically moving on to flooring, right, Daddy? Final steps before we can complete the foundation and move on to framing up the floor. Be 
sure to push that subscribe button to stick around for more. As you can see, we still got a lot left, so. We have to do the walls, we have to do the floor, we have to do the roof.